good morning grade 4 and a warm welcome to the maths class well children this video is a revision video now i am just pointing out the main mistakes what you all are doing children it's nice to see that um, i think the just for a few one or two students rest all of you are submitting your revision and most of your revision is right i'll just show you where you are making mistakes so i'll just focus on those areas so i have done something here children this is with comparing of fractions children okay here i see some confusion when you compare like fractions with equal denominators children that is very simple most of you are getting it right okay remember this of the two fractions with the same denominator the fraction with the greater numerator is a greater fraction so this you are getting it right since 5 is greater than 2 so 5 upon 9 is greater than 2 upon 9 here most of you are making a mistake okay where it is with the equal numerators you see here the denominators are not equal if the numerator of the two fractions are equal then the fraction with the smaller denominator is greater than the other fraction so remember just remember these rules children so 9 upon 2 and 9 upon 5 so now your 2 is less than 5 so 9 upon 2 is greater than 9 upon 5 right i have done this children so please go through this once you go through what i have done children your videos and your lessons you will get it this children many are doing a mistake over here please please pay attention here children remember this decimal point this place value children you all know you all are doing it well unit tens hundred but here children after this this is your tens this is your hundreds and this is your thousands children remember i had done a key and i had shown it to you all the same thing you need to follow now children we have the number over here 378.0.25 now hundreds tens units tens hundreds and thousands so 3 is in the hundreds place this you know 7 is in the tens place and 8 is in the units place this also value you know children it is 300 here it is 70 and in the units it is 8 now the mistake lies here here is where your are getting confused and you all are making a mistake so children see here it is here it is what okay what is given over here tens so this is 1 upon 10 now here i have 0 so 0 upon 10 that will be 0 children the property of division i have taught you 0 okay and even of multiplication please go through all that now hundreds so it is 1 upon 100 the place value of here is 1 upon 100 so 2 will be upon 100 so that is 0.02 right similarly for the thousands children i have 1 upon 1000 and what i have in the thousands place 5 so this will be what 5 upon 1000 children see the number of zeros so this will be 0.005 right i will i will be posting it so please have a look then after that children i seen your no mistake yes this decimal children children remember when there is a decimal please remember this children you first change the decimal fraction into like decimal fraction now look here children after the point here i have one place here after the point i have three places so first i need to change this can you see 9.9 sorry 905.5 is you change this okay make it into like so it is 0905.500 why because this over here is having three digits then you can do the operation of addition right now similarly for your children the sum is subtraction but you see here it is two places here it is three places so what you are going to do first you make it into a make it into a like fraction so here also you will put zero and here also equal number of places and then you subtract 
Now children, this is very very important. Children, this sum, okay, most of you have told me that you find this difficult. Children, there is a trick for this. It is, see now, if the table is 32. Now you don't know this table. So what you are going to do is, children, multiply here at the right hand side. Now many of you children, you are comfortable with this uh, horizontal of way of multiplication. So you can do it here. If you are not, then you do the vertical way. No issues. You have a working column here. You have enough of space. So please do it there. Okay. Now children see this. 32 divided by 1284. Now children as I told you. The divisor. You see the first number. So this is smaller. This is your place value children. Remember unit tens 100,000. So this thousands is smaller than this divisor. Then you move to the next. Now this is also small. Okay. So you have to move to 128. Can you see here? 34 into 4 is 128. And why we are adding zeros children? Because it does not go into this. It's not divisible. And now we are taking. So this 4 you write it here. On top of your. Which place is this? Tens place. Be careful children. Okay. And then you subtract. And then see. You get here. And now you are bringing down this 4. So now 32 doesn't go into this 4 and then you add a 0 over here. That's the trick of doing this sum. Okay. I think the problem was here children with this page 74. So please work this sum. Use this what I have given you over here. And the trick of writing the tables. See children there is enough of space. Write the tables over here. Okay. Now children for your. You have right from this page from page 1 okay so you need to revise all this place values your tables percentage percentage sums okay rounding rounding children you are doing well so go through all the ch uh, chapters you can solve children one or two sums where you find it difficult just solve one or two sums. Where you need practice children I think is this problem sums. Here children the idea is when you read the sum pick up the keywords. Because some of you are confused whether you have to do division. Whether you have to do multiplication. Whether you have to do addition. So children you read the sum and understand keywords. If it is given all together or they will give you equally. How many times. So these are all keywords as I thought. As I have told you. Right? So children, that's all from my side. I think we have, I have given you enough revision. I will put up revision. So please, I am expecting you all to do good, do well in your exams. All the best. Relax children, please relax. Read your paper. You will surely do well. So all the best children. If you have any difficulty, any problem, we are having a Zoom session. You could always tell me your difficulties. Okay. So happy learning children.